Hi, I'm Beth Engelman and this is Mommy on a Shoestring for the Pioneer Press. And today we're going to talk about stress busters using toys that you have in your family playroom. And I'm so thrilled to introduce my two helpers today. We have Avery and Will. And where do you guys live? On the LaGrange. In LaGrange. Wonderful. So uh, we're talking about stress busters because right about now is the time when summer's over and school's beginning. So I have a question for you guys. Do you get stressed? Um, yeah, sort of. Yeah? yeah. Do, does your mom give you any techniques to do when you guys get stressed? Uh -huh. no. no. No? What about you, Avery? No. Has she ever said, just take a deep breath? and calm down. Sometimes. Sometimes, yeah. right. Because taking a deep breath is always good because it's yeah. a good way to fill your lungs with air and also to tax your oral motor system, which means your mouth. So sometimes chewing or sucking or blowing also helps tax your oral motor system and helps quiet your mind and calm your body. And so if you're at home and you're feeling a little, oh, there's just so much to do, try picking up a harmonica or a recorder, a bottle of bubbles, or you can try this technique that we learned, I learned from Dr. Harasides from um, Arlington Pediatrics, and she's an occupational therapist. And what you do, it's called a bubble volcano, and it's super fun to do as parents and as kids, and it's great to do in the bathtub too. You take a tub of water, and you each have one with a straw, and then you're going to pour in bath soap. And since we're working with kids, I like to use um, baby bath soap that's not toxic, just in case they by accident blow up, blow in instead of out. It erupts. I should say you should also have a mat. <laughs> so you guys can stop. That's perfect. So the point, Whoa. how do you guys feel now? Do you feel a little more relaxed? Yeah. From all that blowing, right? And here you have oh, a great yeah. bubble volcano.